You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this and you will find strength. Dwell on the beauty of life, watch the stars, and see yourself running with them. The happiness of your life depends upon the quality of your thoughts. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Everything we see is a perspective, not the truth. Waste no more time to arguing about what a good man should be. Be one. If you are distressed by anything external, the pain is not due to the thing itself, but to your estimate of it, and this you have the power to revoke at any moment. When you arise in the morning, think of what a privilege it is to be alive, to think, to enjoy, to love. The best revenge is to be unlike him who performed the injury. The soul becomes dye with the color of its thoughts. Accept the things to which fate binds you and love the people with whom fate brings you together, but do so with all your heart. It is not death that a man should fear, but he should fear never beginning to live. Never let the future disturb you. You will meet it, if you have to, with the same weapons of reason which today arm you against the present. Our life is what our thoughts make it. Whenever you are about to find fault with someone, ask yourself the following question. What fault of mine most nearly resembles the one I am about to criticize? If it is not right, do not do it. If it is not true, do not say it. The object of life is not to be on the side of the majority, but to escape finding oneself in the ranks of the insane. Very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. The best revenge is not to be like your enemy. Reject your sense of injury, and the injury itself disappears. How much more grievous are the consequences of anger and the causes of it? The first rule is to keep an untroubled spirit. The second is to look things in the face and know them for what they are. Do not act as if you were going to live 10,000 years. Death hangs over you. While you live, while it is in your power, be good. Here is a rule to remember in future. When anything tempts you to feel bitter, not this is misfortune, but to bear this worthily is good fortune. Look well into thyself. There is a source of strength which will always spring up if thou wilt always look. How much time he gains who does not look to see what his neighbor says or does or thinks, but only at what he does himself to make it just and holy. Think of yourself as dead. You have lived your life. Now take what's left and live it properly. 
What doesn't transmit light creates its own darkness. You are a little soul carrying about a corpse, as Epictetus used to say. What we do now echoes in eternity. Do every act of your life as though it were the very last act of your life. Perfection of character is this to live each day as if it were your last without frenzy, without apathy, without pretense. Look back over the past with its changing empires that rose and fell and you can foresee the future too. The impediment to action advances action. What stands in the way becomes the way. The universe is change. Our life is what our thoughts make it. Remember that very little is needed to make a happy life. A man's worth is no greater than the worth of his ambitions. Never esteem anything as of advantage to you that will make you break your word or lose your self-respect. Your days are numbered. Use them to throw open the windows of your soul to the sun. If you do not, the sun will soon set and you with it. Don't go on discussing what a good person should be. Just be one. Receive without conceit, release without struggle. You don't love yourself enough, or you'd love your nature too, and what it demands of you. It is in your power to withdraw yourself whenever you desire. Perfect tranquility within consists and the good ordering the mind, the realm of your own. How ridiculous and how strange to be surprised at anything which happens in life. Life is neither good or evil, but only a place for good and evil. If any man despises me, that is his problem. My only concern is not doing or saying anything deserving of contempt. A person's worth is measured by the worth of what he values. Whatever anyone does or says, I must be emerald and keep my color. The things you think about determine the quality of your mind. Humans have come into being for the sake of each other, so either teach them or learn to bear them.